Curzon, Artificial Eye. Logos of film festivals and awards. Lights in the darkness glint on a lens. Close up of a doctor, mouthing words. White letters on a black screen. In the early 1980s, John Hull lost his sight. John walks down a corridor, loads a cassette, and presses record. He began keeping an audio diary. This is cassette one, track one, notes on blindness. A quote, profound and deeply affecting Wendy Eyed Observer. July the 5th, 1984. What happens to the brain when optic stimulation ceases? I am concerned to understand blindness. Film print disintegrates. The pictures in the gallery of my mind have dimmed somewhat. So I could no longer remember easily what my wife looked like or what my daughter Imogen looked like. His wife, Marilyn. I began to be terribly afraid that I would lose you. John's a thin, distant shadow in the whiteness. Everything was drifting away. How could this happen to me? Who had the right to deprive me of the sight of my children at Christmas time? A tape spools. <clears throat> Darkness. John's son, Thomas, runs through dunes towards the sun. As a young boy, Tom removes John's glasses, fumbles through curtains for an opening. In a field, Marilyn hugs John. Quote, audaciously ambitious, revelatory cinema. Now I find that there's been a strange kind of change in the state of my brain. Profoundly emotional, James Gill, shortlist. There is something so totally purging about blindness that one either is destroyed or renewed. Rain falls indoors. A tsunami engulfs the aisle of a supermarket. I think I am beginning to understand what it's like to be blind. A beach is swallowed by darkness. Notes on blindness in cinemas and on demand from the 1st of July.